the mic is still glitchy. All right, chat. Here's your chance to be extremely helpful. Can you hear me now? It's skipping. Okay. We'll try and fix it, guys. They said it's still skipping, I don't know. Huh? All right, folks, how about this? Is this better? <laughs> I can speak up. I'll be obnoxious. What a new thing. Well, before we get started on Pokemon Snap, let's just say these last donations. We had a $20 donation from Flouse. Brant's here. Nice job, everyone. It's a pleasure to see all these amazing runs. We have $15 from Pharaoh. Hey, y'all. Scrounged up more funds to donate just in time for the Pokemon block, making it my second contribution to SGDQ. Good luck to all the runners. And $10 from Velenath. Last donation of the marathon for me. But as always, it's been great to watch. Thanks for putting this event together. Looking forward to donating again at HDQ. $10 from Anonymous, second donation of the marathon, donating for Pokemon Gold, because yellow is my favorite color. And $17.17 and 17 cents from Gut7, my third GDQ, and great as always, Metal Wolf was hilarious, and Lost Vikings, play one player, two controller, insane. Keep up the craziness. I don't, I don't even know if our mics are on yet. Um, they might be. Are we good? Alright, give me just a second. Right, we'll you want to count down? Alrighty. Are good? Three, two, one, go. Nerd. That's one. <laughs> There's one. <laughs> okay. Uh, so this is Pokemon Snap. Um, it's a game where you go into a bunch of like exotic places and take pictures of Pokemon. Nerd. Uh, yeah, it's a pretty nerdy game. Um, Does that count? So right here, I look up at the sky to reduce lag. Uh, it has trouble rendering everything on the screen, but when you just look at the sky, nothing happens, so we're all good. Um, this Butterfree right here is the only pain in the butt during the run. Hopefully, I just get a good cycle on it. Uh, that was perfect, actually. Yeah. Um, so yeah, that's, we're basically set for the rest of the run now. Uh, <laughs> that's how this game works. As long as Butterfree goes good, I'm fine. Um, so, real quick explanation of this game. Uh, it is an auto-scroller, but you have control over how fast your cart can move. Um, Shoutouts to Riker Z for figuring out how like this cart actually works and how you can control its movement. Um, by looking forward and locking in the camera, you can actually lock in its top speed, and you can keep it that way so you can go and... Uh, Take pictures and go fast because this is a speed run. <laughs> Nerd. Shut up. <laughs> and we have a hundred dollar donation from JTIC. Haven't been able to donate yet this year and I just got home from deployment, but love the event and the cause. Keep up the good work throughout the rest of it. Donation goes to player's choice. Mm. Um Pokemon Gold. Nerd. So do you often get good um, RNG cycles for Lapras and Butterfree? Uh, uh, Butterfree is like 50-50. Everything else usually works good, yeah. Um, so we're going to finish up Beach in here just a second. Alrighty. So now we got to submit the pictures, and we get to listen to Oak's wonderful catchphrases. I'm so excited. Uh, no <laughs> pun intended. I was holding that microphone. What? Yes. He's being nerd. 
I'm, I'm being a nerd right now. And we have a $30 donation from New Witty. Beyond excited to watch Pokemon Snap. Who all remembers printing out tons of Pokemon picture stickers as a kid? Ooh, Ooh that's pretty rough. Okay. Um, one of the pictures got a little messed up there. I can I can deal with it. Oh, Lapras can be a jerk, so. So you mentioned the Butterfree cycle. What happens if you get a bad cycle at the start? Uh, I have to retry the level. It's, it's, uh, this game's fun. There's a sick party going on next door. Yeah, there's the party <laughs> next door is, uh, really loud. Nerds. <laughs> that's all, it's a little distracting. <laughs> From what I remember, I think you're trying to go for like 25,000 points out of beach. Uh, no. What you want out of beach is 18,000. 18,000. I was kind of way off. Oh, uh, we'll see where I'm at right now. I need more points. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to go back into Tunnel real quick, and some free easy points right here. You can wait and just get a picture of Electabuzz. Um, going full marathon strats. <laughs> <laughs> and we have $10 from a cat lady. Hello, and great job, everyone. Excited about the Pokemon block. <laughs> and we have $50 from Sam4 <laughs> with no comment. Jeez, they're loud next door. <laughs> they're just sitting there screaming. I really hope Stream can hear that. I, I really hope they can, because it's <laughs> priceless. It's priceless. Actually, someone offered me a ticket into it once. Are you kidding me? You didn't go? I, yeah. I wanted to hang out and watch Carmers. <laughs> Everybody wants to watch Pokemon Snap, yeah, seriously. Oh, gosh. Nerds. Nerds. <laughs> All right, Flash. so we came out of um, tunnel right there, and we got the apples so that I can get a, a better picture of Electabuzz because my first one was bad. Um, I don't really have much to explain right now. Uh, I guess right here, if you hit the electrode, I'm going to get a quick picture of him. Hitting that electrode will make these cocoonas come down so you can get a perfect picture of them. Uh, that... That took me a while to figure out. Um, sometimes it can actually like go wrong, but I get lucky. So, uh, Zubat right there can be a pain if you're bad at it, but I'm like the best, so whatever. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Nerd. <laughs> Good thing to probably mention for people who haven't played Snap. Um, a lot of these Pokemon has a special pose. If you do a certain action to them, and they give you bonus points if you snap at them at that certain pose. Yeah. Um, the most valuable picture in the game, excluding Mew, is the fighting Magmar, and that's because you get so many bonus points for it being a special picture. That is really <laughs> loud next door. We got a concert going on next door. Yeah, that's, that's pretty interesting. It's, it, they're all hyped for Snap right now. I mean, Speaking who of interesting Who isn't hyped for Snap? Come on. We have a $50 donation from P. Brian. Keep up the good work, everyone. And another $50 donation from Anonymous. I love that you guys are playing Pokemon Snap. This takes me back, growing up with all my N64 games. <laughs> Flash ban Viva looking. <laughs> uh, alrighty, so... <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm gonna try to block out Couch, because they're being like worse than I thought they'd be. Shut up, guys. Um, right here, I gotta bunch these guys together so I can get a picture of the Magneton. Um, multiple things in this game require points. Uh, where's the third one? Oh, back there. Snipe. Oh. Alrighty, got it. Farmer's um, a quick shot. Huh? Got that quick shot. Got the quick shot, yeah. 360, no scope. <laughs> Very nice. MLG's why. <laughs> <laughs> so when are you applying for MLG? Um, as soon as possible. Snap's the best first-person shooter, so... Actually, it's a rail shooter. Just ask uh, Radman. Ah, uh, rail shooters, yeah. <laughs> You're literally killing Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> Not yet. I don't have my pester balls yet. Eventually. <laughs> my face. <laughs> I did kill that Electabuzz. Rip in peace, buddy. Here comes the Bible thumbs. He lived a good life. 
He tried his hardest. Well done. Well done. Thank you. Wonderful. So, uh, real quick, uh, t tidbit. I'm running this game on the US version right now. Japanese is faster, but Oak doesn't say wonderful, so I mean. <laughs> What's I even mean, the point of playing it? Yeah. Professor Oak's the best part of this, right? Yeah, Professor Oak is honestly the best part of this game. Like, what would it be without its catchphrases? Seriously. Just so memorable and quotable. I had to play it. I'm just gonna lure this full pixel. Actually, full is the best part of the game. Yeah, full is PQ. I'm pretty sure the ending credits are better. <laughs> ending credits are pretty good. Has nice music. This entire game has pretty good music in general. No. <laughs> but it is. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so we're doing a bit more staring at the sky. Um, get used there. to that. <laughs> Alright, coming around right here, we need to. Drag the Charmander out into the Magmar. This can go wrong, but uh, did pray. <laughs> okay. Who's the nerd now? <laughs> Both of us. Okay. All right, that actually Charmander. worked out really good. Charmander was never the same. So Charmander just killed that Magmar right there, and um, yeah. Alright, so Moltres is going to come out of this egg. Um, I'm behind on points, so I'm going to wait for him to do a special pose so I can get extra. Right there. Another thing about this game is it's uh, very open routed. As long as you have enough points to complete the game, it's totally cool. Uh, I think the funnest part about this game is like slowly figuring out what you have to get as you go through the run. Um, you know, it plays mind games with you. And uh, it's it's slowly driven me insane over the years, but whatever. Minor details. No, please. Nerds. Shots. Nerds. All right, so I zoom in right there to get a picture of Poliwag. I mean, I bet it didn't look like it, but Oak, Oak saw Poliwag somewhere there, so uh, I'm going to run off that. Uh, I'm gonna go over here and get the Bulbasaur real quick because I am behind on points. Nerd. I'm a nerd. You can't uh, get the you can't get the other ones out. Uh, with uh, the you apple, can't right? get the other ones out of the tree stumps without the uh, pester balls. So I'm just gonna get that one for now. That was a picture of a polywag. Yeah, the first one was <laughs> obviously a picture of a polywag. You were close. You were close. Alrighty, plenty enough points out now. <laughs> and how many total points do you need again? Yes. Um, by the end of the game, I need 130,000. Uh, and to do that and not have to go into levels multiple times is actually quite difficult. Um, writing out the, when to take pictures of Pokemon and when not to uh, is actually quite difficult, and it changes from run to run. Pester Ball's so mean. Yeah, I'm literally killing Pokemon right now. <laughs> so like the poison. chat is requesting a roll call. Oh, they requested a roll call? You go first. Okay. Well, I'm Karmers. Nerd. I'm K Hearts. Nerd. I'm Viva Gaming 360. Nerd. 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 <laughs> I'm GC. Nerd. Are we going all the way over here? Sure. Sure, why not? I don't know if you can hear me. I'm oh. Mr. Monopoly. That's Nerd. Mr. Monopoly. And Reed Tiburon. And that, that's Reed Tiburon over there. <laughs> I only think you guys are on camera. I think you're like, like, a lot. <laughs> I said that a lot. Okay. Yeah. That's the idea. Oh, okay. Now I get it. Not learned this yet. We discussed it at breakfast. Oh yeah, right there. You have to take like, like three really quick pictures. Um, you get a picture of the cloister on the tail of Slowpoke, and that that's actually a bonus point picture in that game. Um, it counts as Shelter evolving, even though nothing's happening to it. And the other two are just pictures of Slowpoke's butt and uh, Slowbro. So I mean, the best pictures. The best right. pictures are Pokemon butt. Lewd. Just saying. Lewd, lewd, lewd. Get lewd. Or get boobs. All right, so coming up here, uh, we got a big thing in my chat called uh, Praise the Cloister Gods. Because Cloister up here is 100% uh, based on RNG. 
kind of just got to hope he comes out. If not, it's not a huge deal. He didn't come out first. That's not a good sign. Oh, there he is. Hey, closer guys. <laughs> that actually scared me. I didn't think he came up, and then I look over, and he's just sitting right there, and I actually there jumped. <laughs> but yeah, that, that worked out well. Um, now I'm happy. I feel like you need to say nerd. I no. disagree wholeheartedly. I, I disagree too, actually. Yeah, yeah, I'm nerd. Okay, fine, I'll stay at this level. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Medium nerd. <laughs> so I'm going to submit all these wonderful pictures. Is that, is that shelter on fire? Is no, it's evolving. Oh, gosh. I explained this earlier. <laughs> and we have a $50 donation from Perrylicious, longtime watcher, first time donating. I just have to donate to hear the lady with the voice speak. Um, best of luck to the runners. Put this donation towards the runner's choice. All right, I have 98,000. Um, that's not actually that terrible. I can live with that. Yeah. Yes. 98,000 points, just to, just to clarify. Best level incoming. <laughs> okay, this, this level is definitely the best just because of its music. Um, it's, I just like to play this at the end of my stream sometimes because it's soothing and I like it. Nerd. I'm a nerd. literally the meme. All right, so if you take a picture of the Grimer at the beginning like I did, uh, this Grimer will just randomly appear here, so you can get some pictures of him. If you throw the Pester Ball at him and take a picture of him while he's mid-animation, you get, still get full points even if he's not facing you. The Snipes. Snipes, 360 no scope right there. Looks like Monkey's flicking you off. <laughs> <laughs> what a nerd. <laughs> Viva, please. Viva, please. <laughs> this is literally my job. We talked about it at breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> he paid for breakfast, and in, in return, I had to let him say memes on, or nerds on the couch a lot, couch a lot. so I mean. Wait, but. What? No, he was the freeloader. He was the freeloader, that's why he's. I s he volunteered. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> stay <you> freeloaded. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I'm good, and then you're like, no, you're eating, I'm buying. <laughs> Just as a reminder, guys, this is Summer Games Done Quick 2014, and we're raising money to send to Doctors Without Borders. Um, so make sure you get those donations in. We've raised a lot so far, but we've got uh, a lot more that we can do. All right, so if you take a picture of the Victory Bell as he uh, pops out of the water right there, whoops, I unsubmitted a picture, uh, you can get max points for it, even though he's like upside down and you can hardly even tell what he is. Like that. That's a nice victory belt, but <laughs> dude. <laughs> Wonderful. 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 All right, points seem to be uh, decent. Wonderful. Points are very wonderful. All right, I'm gonna 119. Nice. I'm gonna have to take uh, three pictures in Valley. Uh, so, uh, it's good for the run, which means I'm getting a better time, but it's bad for the stream, which because I'm just gonna be staring at the sky a lot. So you're gonna have to forgive me for that. You're not gonna get Gyarados? I will get Gyarados. Oh yes. I'm getting um spoilers. <laughs> yeah, let it happen, Whoops. dude. I Gyarados mean, isn't even in this. I mean, game. Magikarp. <laughs> Blame stream delay. <laughs> Couch is over here spoiling the game. I've never seen the end before. <laughs> is there? You're a nerd. <laughs> Pretty sure we're all nerds. Uh Magikarp, where you at? Where are you at, bro? Whoa. He's like, okay, there he is. That's, that was very interesting. <laughs> what? Uh, you hit the Magikarp over to the Mankey, and Mankey will just beat it, and it flies over a mountain, and um, it evolves into Gyarados later. I, I don't know what else to say about that. <laughs> so just uh, maximizing speed right now, uh, going full auto-scroller. All right, I got that. You have like five frames to take a picture of Sand Slash and still get like good points for it. Uh, so it can go wrong because he'll start like digging into the ground and Oak will not realize it's a Sand Slash anymore. What FPS is snap? Frames per second? Yeah. Uh, this game runs at 29.97, I think. 30. So 30. I might actually be wrong on that though, so 
anybody really cares, they can oh, hello. search it up. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna get Gyarados here. Uh, Gyarados lags a lot, so getting him, uh, getting a picture of him, and then getting him off screen again is like what you want to do because he can be a pain. There's a there's no sensitivity setting on like the actual. There's no sensitivity setting in this game. It just depends on the controller you use. Uh, I feel like you move it faster than I was able to. Oh, uh, that's weird because the controller I use, the joystick, is literally about to fall off. <laughs> All right, so we hit Dragonite out right here. Wait for him to do his cute poses. Dragonite hype. All right, and now we need to snipe Squirtle into the Mankey on top of the mountain. Squirtle, no. Watch him go. Bam, okay. So he's gonna fall over, and he's gonna be sitting right next to a button conveniently. So we're gonna have to uh, sacrifice the Mankey for the Urn Gods, and uh, Finish out Valley. That was actually not a bad snipe. Rip Mankey. Rip Mankey. So Volcano and um, this stage are the only ones you have to complete. Rip and rip. Like to the end. To the end. Uh, not Volcano. This is. Or not Volcano. Sorry. Um, River. River. Yeah. Yes. Tunnel. Tunnel. You don't. You quit. Tunnel. Uh, River and Valley are the only ones you physically have to go to the end of the level. And we have a $45.17 donation from Anonymous. The combination of uh, Pokemon Snap and Charity is causing me to melt in my chair, having to send this donation in while I still have physical form. Wonderful. That is so troll. I am 200 points away from having oh, enough. wow. That's okay. I can't believe that just happened. Okay, so what I have to do here is go in the beach and get a picture of Snorlax just while I'm here, uh, casually stride along. Pikachu on a surfboard. Um, Pikachu on a surfboard lit, like t probably wouldn't even get me 200 points. Yeah. Because I already got the Pikachu on the electrode. Oh, so yeah. So sniping him and just getting a picture and quitting course will get me the points I need. So another reason why you probably picked this stage too is because you can double dip into the science? Yep. Double dip. That was an interesting word choice. Well, you know. <laughs> I mean, it's not wrong. It's not wrong. Kill two birds with one stone, then. Basically. That's kind of cool. Kill the animals. <laughs> I, I wholeheartedly support this notion. <laughs> I mean, we're, kill we're killing the Pokemon right now, yeah. so. When you're done, please put all your donations towards killing the animals. Yes. Um, I already put my donations towards Pokemon Gold. Whoops. Should have killed the animals. Maybe next year. <laughs> Maybe next year. <laughs> and we have a $15 donation from Kelly with no comment and a $20 donation from Brendan. He says, thanks for all the entertainment and information, guys and girls. It's been a lot of fun watching the stream again. Yes. And $15 from Rifu. Go SGDQ. Yeah. Yeah. Go SGDQ. <laughs> <laughs> yes. That's his name. <laughs> You're SGDQ? Uh, I, I'm apparently SGDQ. The SGDQ? The. Yeah, I'm, I'm just oh. a nerd. I'm just a nerd. They found the same thing, right? Nerds. <laughs> and a $20 donation from Hadri with no comment. Well, now you're telling them to. <laughs> You're and a seventy-five dollar donation from Suzark with no comment. Thank you, Suzark. Alrighty, so we're just uh, finishing out taking all the signs and the levels here. Um, once you get all the signs, you can unlock the final course of the game, and you can get that final picture of Mew and see those beautiful credits. It took me a long time to figure out that that was coughing. Oh, yeah, that's that's supposed to be a coughing sign. It just literally just looks like a puff of smoke. <laughs> Playing through as a kid, I was totally unaware. I never found that as a kid. <laughs> you never beat the game? You never. Yeah, you have to get that sign to beat the game. Oh. Well, actually, my older brother took that picture for me. Filthy he's casual. a nerd now. My older brother, he's the one that found it. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Good skip Got right it. there. Good that's skip. Cool. Um, you 
it's kind of hard to skip past him without like wasting a bunch of time. Um, I kind of went full yellow right there. Uh, went just walked past by. That was nice. Nice. All right, so we have Pikachu electrocute the egg with Zapdos in it, so he can power the generator, and I can get the final sign before Rainbow Cloud. Okay. <laughs> I got trolled really hard right there. <laughs> I almost quit course. That would have been that would have been um, interesting. To say the least. To say the least. Yeah. Would have been for, an event, for a very eventful. What would morning. you have called them if that happened? Come back. What? A nerd. Dumb. Oh, okay. Oh, dang. <laughs> and we have ten dollars from Swanner. Had to donate during the Pokemon block. I've been a Poke nerd since Gold and Silver came out. Good luck to all the runners to come, and shout out to all the people that make the GDQ marathons awesome. All right, so we gotta quickly uh, wreck this Mew. Mew, no. Rip Mew. Rip and rip. Why does this game nice. encourage Pokemon abuse? Those are really good um, snipes. You literally throw things at Pokemon. You literally kill Pokemon in this game. I'm not kidding. And they get pissed and you off get rewarded, at you. And you get rewarded for it. And oh, Professor Oak so is just close. like... Sometimes, like, yeah. they just go through. I yeah. Like, Professor Oak is like, good job pissing that <laughs> Pokemon off. Yeah, good job. Good job by, uh, like, killing that Pokemon over there. <laughs> Extra points. Times two. <laughs> Times two. Times two. And we have a $2 donation from Anonymous. I just want to say that I really love the couch guys of this run. Keep up the entertainment. <laughs> <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why would you like them? By the way, get ready with the time. The guy sounds like a nerd. <laughs> We're almost done. You made it. And time. See you later. <laughs> Nerd. I, I can take that. I can take that. So, if I counted well, correctly. That was, that was better than my practice, so how like, many, okay. 20 minutes ago. No so whatever. How many times did I call somebody a nerd this run? Too I many. I think if I counted correctly, it was like 36. That's it? Yeah, you slacked. Nerd. Nerd. <laughs> uh, I want to give a quick shout out to uh, Sidewalks for keeping me off the street. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> to put this run in perspective, I think the world record for this Karmers has is a high 21 uh, on the Japanese part. <laughs> Japanese part of. <laughs> the US time is a 22.06. That wasn't the best of runs, but I can live with it. So, yeah. Marathon. Uh, thanks for watching. Good job, you nerd. Bye, chat. I love you. Kind of. I'm headed. All right, guys, just as a reminder, my name is Brittany, and this is Summer Games Done Quick 2014. We're raising money to send to Doctors Without Borders. Um, so make sure you get those donations in, and we'll read them on stream, and we'll just have a blast. Uh, looks like, if I'm not crazy, the next run is going to be Pokemon Red. Um, and it looks like it's going to be a race as well, so let's play Am I Right? We're going to find out pretty soon. So we have a $5 donation from Cody Ox. Thanks for the awesome Metroid Fusion race yesterday. Looking forward to a link to the past. Keep up the great work. And I would love to read more of your guys' donations, but you gotta send them in. So make sure you guys are sending those in and uh, get in for some awesome prizes uh, for the grand prizes and for the Pokemon block. Well, it sounds like we're gonna have some shenanigans pretty soon. <laughs> the name of the um, runner. So, uh, those donations that you guys are getting in, uh, we're uh, going to read them if you send them in. It's going to be pretty good. Just uh, waiting in the setup time right now. Would love to read your donations. And I need to speak up because the mic is uh, cutting out. I apologize, guys. I am not used to talking this loud, and uh, we'll just make it happen.
just to clarify, chat is just cutting in and out. So I just need to speak up. 